What's up guys, it's your boy Oprah C back here with another video. Today I'm gonna be giving you a look inside SEO and giving you five tips and tricks that will help you actually grow your channel and start a YouTube channel easily. I know you might say how I'm gonna tell you how to start a YouTube channel and how to grow when I only have 13 subscribers, but I'm gonna show you some factual detail and show you how I got on first page of YouTube almost on all my videos. So, if you want to learn how to do that, stick around to the end of the video. So the first thing I got on my list is choose a topic. Once you choose a topic or topic, stick to it. The reason why you should stick to them topics is because you want to stay in a certain area. You don't want to be all out the box. Uh, if you do vlogs, pranks, and reactions, it's going to be three different types of people on your channel. One that want to see the vlogs, one that want to see the reaction, and one that might want to see the pranks, okay? So that's what you don't want to do. You, wanna, you don't want to have a channel full of different people that come to see different content. All you want to have is people based around, I would say, no more than two type of contents. I do tutorials and reactions because I want to help you guys grow your channel like mine is growing. I've gained 13 subscribers in two weeks. That's something a lot of YouTubers are not doing. They don't gain one subscriber in a month, okay? So this is something I've been learning how to do and how to get on first page. And just a little fun fact of the day, most people who start YouTube don't even last more than a year on their YouTube channel because they get discouraged. And so don't be those type of people who get discouraged. That was just a fun fact of the day. So after you done found that great topic, you have all you guys have chosen. Now all you want to do is now you want to learn SEO. So now I'm going to give you a five minute in-depth detail SEO. SEO stands for search engine optimization. If you don't know what search engine optimization is, well, it's in the word search. So it's basically in YouTube, it's the second largest search engine around. So basically, like my computer, I'm looking at my computer screen over here. Y'all might not see it, but if you go up to that little search bar, and basically whatever words you typed in has something to do with SEO or watch time minutes okay so what most people tell you that you're gonna need great tags which is also correct to get you right on the first page but you're gonna also need watch time well, the reason why you're gonna need watch time is because uh, YouTube counts relevancy if you're not getting no watch time and people are not watching your videos for a longer period they're not gonna boost you up and push you in a recommendation section section where you want to be in one VID got one over 1,000 views had deleted because it was copyrighted okay so that's how I gained most of my subscribers because I put tags and I did my tags good enough to get put in their recommendation section to where I can get seen by other um, um, channels or people who watch on YouTube and that's how I gain subscribers so now since you have picked that topic and you learn about how to get on that front page now your first video on your YouTube channel is not going to be your best video. Even if you know the to topic so well in detail, there's other people who know it probably better than you and probably have been doing YouTube videos longer than you can imagine. Because I know like Ali, Ali A, he didn't been doing videos since I was 2006. I was only five. He been doing videos since I was five, and I'm like 15 now, basically. So he been doing videos for 10 years, okay? So he's going to be better at whatever you do. Just like gaming reactions, everything. If the people have been doing longer than you, they're most likely going to be better than you. Or you might just have that gift and talent to dominate SEO, to dominate topics, to make an interesting video that people want to click on. Be able to have your first thumbnail that's outstanding and be able to get 100 subscribers off of it. But it's not many people like that. But So my tip all in all is perfect your craft. Do something every day that's going to contribute to whatever your topic is. If you don't know what your topic is yet, you still haven't figured out how to start a YouTube channel. And you still don't probably don't know how to do SEO. So my best bet to you is keep looking for your topic. Look at something you want to do. Or you don't have to upload videos as soon as you start creating videos. You just can look at different videos or do different topics that you might, you know, think you might want to upload. And then at the end when you figure it out, make sure you go ahead and upload it to your YouTube channel to have your first video up. So, the next tip and all in this is basically all you need to do is to promote your YouTube channel. Tell people that you created a YouTube channel. I know it's a lot of people out there who are really willing to come and subscribe to your channel if your videos is of high quality. Okay, this is a life story right here. So basically, when I started out, I had zero subscribers, just like anybody else, okay? But I was on my different channel. I'm on my gaming channel. It's called Poise TV. I started off with zero subscribers, but I gained 400 subscribers in in three months but the first month I gained 100 subscribers so I kept doing that and I ended up with 400 subscribers so basically all I did was basically plan marketing if I didn't do a video today I was marketing my video across all different type of social media platforms 
So some of you can use Instagram, Twitter, and Facebook because I know y'all probably got those. I don't have Facebook and all of this nonsense. But basically, I just promote and tell people to come subscribe to my channel. Uh, basically, I started off with not the best quality audio. I didn't start off with the camera that I'm using now. I'm using a Nikon Coolpix camera that shoots uh, eight times wide and it have a wide shot to get the full body type thing. But yeah, I didn't start off with that. I started off with basically nothing really. Actually, I started off with my phone because I was doing videos, gaming videos. I wanted a face cam so bad. And um, the reason why I didn't get one, I didn't tell my mom I had a YouTube channel. so. Uh, that's why she looking at me weird when I said I needed a camera. So then after I got the camera and showed her what I was doing, she said, oh, and I was like, oh, I got a YouTube channel. And she was perfectly fine with it. She was actually excited about it. So, uh, yeah, I didn't start off with the best quality. I didn't start off with the, with the just awesome lighting that I have now. I didn't start off with none of that. I started off little. I didn't know too much about YouTube. So, yeah, so perfect your craft every day and stick to things that, you know, you like to do and stick to that category hey guys so what you want to do is create a schedule uh please upload monday wednesdays and fridays those are the best time when you look into seo you see monday wednesday and friday i don't know what it is about monday wednesdays and fridays that people watch content a lot and saturdays actually too but i don't know why people watch it like they skip tuesdays and thursdays I but yeah, those are the best days. Um, I would say four to six o'clock because if you're going for a younger base, fan base, whatever, I don't know, uh, you want to upload after the time they get out of school. You don't uh, want to upload during they get to school because when they get to, from, from school, they're going to be looking for a recently uploaded video. Now, if your video old, it's not. It's going to be up, but it's not going to pop up as soon as they go on there as just uploaded five minutes ago. So now they're going to want to click on it. Now, this right here, this is just a bonus tip. Stay patient with YouTube. YouTube won't blow, you won't blow up overnight. You won't gain a million subscribers in a year. You won't gain um, a million likes or you won't gain a, a, how many ever, whatever you think that's very out there. When you first start, don't expect all that. Don't, because if you start YouTube for the wrong reason, your channel will fail. Everything will fail if you start for the wrong reason. Or if you start for the wrong reason, it's not going to grow as fast as it would if you was not going for the things that you are really wanting that's not really that important. But I have seen people channels that grow a million subscribers in a uh, year. They did like tricks, scooter tricks. I don't know. They they just did some trick stuff. But anyways, all in all, this was the whole video. If you guys enjoyed the video, go down below, hit the subscribe button, hit the like button. It was your boy Oprah C back here with another video. Peace out guys and stay up.